you need to know these fundamental trig limits for your AP calculus exam. The limit of sine x over x as x approaches zero equals one. And you can use this to solve a problem like the limit of sine of four x over x as x approaches zero. We want this to look like sine of a thing divided by that thing. And we can do that by putting a four in the denominator. Then we need to put a four out front to compensate. Now we have sine of a thing over a thing. X is approaching zero, of course, but that's the same as four x approaching zero. And so this is equal to four times this limit, which is this limit, which is one. The limit of one minus cosine x over x as x approaches zero is zero. You could use this to solve a problem like the limit of secant x minus one over x as x approaches zero. Secant is one over cosine, one is cosine over cosine, so you can write it like this and then combine those fractions to get the limit of one minus cosine x over cosine x times x with x approaching zero. And then we can use the limit product law to split it up into a product of this limit, which is zero, and this limit. Plug in zero in the denominator and we find it's equal to zero.